I know we were all probably upset with what Nerfantic did to when it, when it comes to the radius increase. And they pull one over us. But it seems like some people figure out a trick to keep it. Pokemon Go fan reveals trick to keep spawn radius increase after nerf. After the nerf. <laughs> so, before we dive right in, uh, if I don't go over something or if there's links in this article, which there most likely will be, there, there will be underlined in red when it comes to this our, uh, this website and this article. Um, then you can go to the disc, uh, description and click the link in the description. If I don't go over something, that's if I don't go over something, or maybe you want to read it yourself, that's why you go to the, to the link. Or maybe there's a, a link in there, but the next uh, link will be the Discord link. I do sell cheap coins, raid passes, and items, and they all each have their own promo. It's only for your first purchase. After that, uh, the ones that do have do have a membership, which they bought a membership on YouTube or they bought a subscription on Twitch, then they will be able to use keep using that promo for however long they stay as a member or a subscriber. On each uh, both of those platforms and if you want to know how it's done how everything is done then you can go to the discord uh, link click the link and uh, there's at the bottom of the coin shop you can see the Camelot shop guide where uh, how it's done how everything's done that's for every shop that's how it's all done and um, yeah that is it for that guys right there hopefully that is interesting for you and you can click that link remember it will be in the description if you want to click the link all right let's dive right in uh pokemon go fan a pokemon go fan has shared a useful trick that lets poke uh that lets players keep the increased spawn radius present in patch 0 0.75 on both android and ios let me guess keep the game open when patch uh, 0.275 was released. Pokemon Go players were ecstatic to see that Nerfantic had doubled the range at which players could interact with and catch Pokemon. This increase up to 80 meters was widely considered a fantastic quality of life addition. However, just three days after that update, Nerfantic followed up with another update that reverted this change. Unsurprisingly, the response from the community was overwhelming slash, uh, and negative. Overwhelmingly negative. There, there you go. However, a Pokemon Go attorney has posted a trick that lets players keep the spawn radius, increase, and continue catching Pokemon from further away. Pokemon Go trick lets you keep 0 0.275 increased spawn radius. A simple trick has been discovered that lets you keep the increased spawn radius pre present in the pit uh, in the patch 0 uh, 0.275 that players on all platforms can take advantage of. The post uh, the post detailing the trick reads: PSA, toggle off auto updates to enjoy. Uh, 275.0 spawn radius increase until uh, 275.1 is forced. They won't force the update until the rollout is complete on all of uh, app stores. Uh, hopefully, they they're uh, messed that up uh, before too. No, so we should be able to use 275.0. For a while longer. So that's how you do. I thought you just leaving the app open and not up. But uh, yeah, what if happens? What happens if you already updated it? It was already forced update or not a uh, forced update. Auto updated already. For Android, this uh, involves the following process: Open the Google Play Store app, click your profile picture. 
and in the top right corner select uh, settings select network prefer preference final finally set auto update apps to don't auto update apps for iOS users open the settings app uh, scroll down and select app store under the automatic downloads uh, section make sure app updates are disabled keep in mind this trick will only work if you haven't already updated uh, to the current version furthermore patch uh, 0 0.275 won't be supported forever and Nerfantic will eventually force players to update its uh, update is, is currently known how quickly a forced update will arrive could be could be the next few days because if people figure out this way and Nerfantic is not going to like that then they're going to force you to get a forced update like nope you got to play now now you got to play they always sometimes they always do that because there's other players that like the other features that they took away in the next update so people like that previously now they took it away all right guys that is it for this video make sure to smash that like button smash the subscribe button ring the bell for notifications share the video uh, put your thoughts in the comment section don't forget about the links in the description uh, the ones that I mentioned earlier they'll be in the description you can click those if you want to come join me on the discord you don't have to buy the cheap coins you don't have to buy anything to join uh, it's free to join I don't I don't really care if you join or uh, I don't care if you join for the coins or not but thank you and I'll see you on the next video guys hopefully this uh, interested to you and uh, Hopefully this helps you out. Thank you and I'll see you on the next one. Peace out.